Hello everyone, Chief here with some Halo news, this time about Halo Nightfall and his protagonist, Agent Locke. Today we got our first looks of Agent Locke in Halo Nightfall as played by Mike Coulter. Halo Nightfall is a live action digital series produced by Ridley Scott and will function similarly to Halo 4 Forward Unto Dawn. The series is focused around Agent Locke and his origin story and will bring us right to the doorstep of Halo 5 Guardians. In the live action digital series, Coulter plays an agent with the Office of Naval Intelligence, or ONI, whose team is sent to investigate terrorist activity on a distant colony world and are eventually drawn to an ancient hellish artifact during their search. Even without a background in the Halo universe, Coulter said that the script was incredibly gripping. It introduces an intriguing and mysterious world that I wanted to know more about. Halo Nightfall will cater to hardcore Halo fans, but it's also designed so newcomers to the franchise can easily enter the Halo universe, identify with the characters, and be entertained by the story being told. Coulter explains a scene to us where he's chasing an enemy who poses a serious threat to the people Agent Locke has sworn to protect through the city. The scene is an action-packed sequence that involves some special effects and a lot of coordination with the stunt team to fulfill the director's vision. Now, Agent Locke is a character that will play a key role in Halo 5 Guardians. Halo Nightfall is his origin story, and it will lend us some insight to who Locke is and who he will become. From the trailer of this year's E3, we know that in Halo 5 Guardians, Agent Locke, with the help of the Arbiter, is searching for the Master Chief. Now recently you may have heard that Microsoft is closing down Xbox Entertainment Studios. This Xbox branch was responsible for all their original entertainment productions, such as Steven Spielberg's Halo television series and Ridley Scott's Halo Nightfall. However, with the studio's closure, Phil Spencer stated that both the TV series and Halo Nightfall will both continue as planned along with any other projects that are already in production. So these are all safe. Now in a few days, 3 for 3 Industries will have a panel for Halo Nightfall at this year's San Diego Comic Con, so expect to hear more news later this weekend, as the panels at Comic Con are not live stream, but they promise they'll be uploading videos over the weekend on YouTube, so stay tuned. That is all I have for you guys today, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, as always likes, favorites, and comments are greatly appreciated, subscribe if you haven't already for the latest in Halo news and Halo content. My name's Chief Canuck, and I'm signing out.